doing, everybody? Hope everybody's having a fantastic day, man. Look here. This is going to be a, a short and sweet video. So we are headed out in a few minutes to a lake that we have not fished in quite a while. All right? I talked to a buddy of mine, and he, he told me he some regular colors, you know, they're biting, they're kind of finicky, the weather's been crazy. He said, you know, white and chartreuse, black and chartreuse, just your regular jigs that you always bring when you come fishing down here. He said, but this week, the more natural, the better. All right, we're going to use a one-eighth head, y'all. One-eighth wedge head, all right? We're not going to paint it. It's just regular lead, no paint. All right, <clears throat> so natural, right? I'm going to tie me a couple of jigs, just natural. We're going to go with a 210 flat wax, dandy or thread, y'all. Uh, <clears throat> sometimes if that thread sets or you get it, uh, it gets hung on something, it gets a little nick in it. And I should have cut it off. 99, 9.99% 9 of the times I always cut the end of it off, you know, because it sits over there in my little <laughs> container. And it gets uh, gets caught up on something. So make sure and double check your thread when you start tying. All right. So we want to go more natural, right? Natural, natural, natural. We have the flash of blue in silver, y'all. We got to double that up. I want double the flash. All right. Hold that against your thread. Tie that sucker in. All right. Since I doubled it, I'm going to come down here and cut it. All right. Make sure all four of them are different lengths. See how them are the same? We're going to cut one down. They're all four different lengths now. All right. Now, natural, natural, natural. Let's think about it now. <clears throat> we are trying to mimic the minnow, right? We are trying to mimic the minnow. So, I have some of my, my fiber, synthetic hair. All right. You don't see me sometimes, you know, it comes in a package. Sometimes I have leftovers, you know, and I just put them in my little drawer down there, and it goes everywhere. So, anyway. That was some little leftovers I had. It was in my drawer. They were about the right length. I just trimmed them up a little bit. We're going to throw them bad boys on there. Couple of light wraps. Till you get it where you want it. Uh-huh. Then the cinch are on down, y'all. Make sure you wrapping that. A nice, even, tight wrap, y'all. From the base of that head all the way to the tip of that hook. Remember, that's what's, what's holding everything together, right? Then I'm going to tie it all. That is what's holding everything together, y'all. Tied it all. Made sure my knot, knot was a little, you know, tight. Let's see now. Natural, natural, natural. We want it natural, right? So, a minute, you know, they got a lot of flash to them, y'all. They got a little gray. They got a little silver. You know, some of them, you look at them, they got a little bluish to them. All right. So, we're going to use a new age pearl Chanel. And this is just a white woolly bugger. All right. I'm going to double it up, so I'm going to strip that Chanel off back to the thread, right? I want this thing shiny, shiny, shiny. Oh, but wait. Remember, I said these minnows, you know, they have uh, all kind of different colors to them, right? Red, I mean, bluish patterns. I'm serious. Take a minnow one day, put this up in some water. And, uh, you know, look at it the different lights, you know, put some light to it. You'll see all kind of different colors. So look what we're going to do. 
This is our uh, crystal flash or accent, you know, flash or boo, whatever you want to call it. Everybody calls it something different. I always put in my uh, videos, you know, exactly where I get it from. So now, if I can find my down scissors, y'all, everything will be okay. But look, luckily I keep scissors all over this desk. They're everywhere. And once you get set up, try to keep everything, you know, close to you. That way, you know, get you some bins and stuff like that. That way you don't have to keep getting up and, and moving around. And it helps out a lot if everything is real close to you. Using that blue pearl, y'all. Using that blue pearl, we got to tie it in. Once we get it tied in, we got to go back and cut All right where I folded it over. First, we got to tie that bad boy off. Make sure or not, boop, make sure or not, it's tight, right? When we double and triple it over, we just got to go in there and cut those. Uh, sometimes it's hard to see. You don't want to cut none of your flash. So just take your time and uh, make sure that soccer, you don't, you know, make sure you don't cut into your flash. Building jigs is not no speed racing. You know, you don't have to get in no hurry. I know a lot of people, you know, me, myself included, when I get in a hurry, you know, I uh, kind of miss some steps, and especially people that are trying to learn to tie jigs, it does, you know, it does them no good, you know. When you miss a step or you don't explain something, you know, to me, when I watch a video, I want everything explained. You know, I want to know why they did it, how they did it, you know, and I'll comment on a video, hey, man, why did you do this like this? And I get the same thing, you know, from customers every day or, you know, my viewers, and I appreciate it, you know, and I answer every one of those questions, you know. People will ask all the time why I do things like I do, you know, and I honestly, you know, I appreciate all the feedback, and if you have any questions on why I do a certain thing the way I do, do not hesitate. Please do not hesitate. All right, when I'm wrapping this around, I know I say it all the time, but, you know, I get a lot of new viewers every single, or subscribers every single week, and thank y'all so very much. It, that means the world to me, man, to be able to help, you know, so many people. I mean, it honestly means the world. I love to be able to help people. Right, so when I'm doing that, you see me take my fingers, you see me what I did, I made sure that that was tight, right? The body material. All right, we're going to tie that sucker off. Couple in the front, a couple in the back. And I always, I don't hold myself to the couple in the front, couple in the back. You know, sometimes I do three or four in the front, three or four in the back. This right here is where I miss my other scissors. See, in all my other videos, you'll notice I don't miss nothing when I'm curved scissors. Well, these scissors are not curved. And look what I did. Now I'll have to roll that jig around when I get done tying, and I'll have to cut that. Uh -huh. Even though we're using white thread y'all we're still gonna build it up because that white that white is a little bit different color than you know my body material so i wanted many colors in this jig that i can get to attract that back all right i got him built up enough let's see here Cut that bad boy off. My deal turned on me. So, then my jig, you don't want that to happen. But, uh, I don't know. See, the couple of places that where I cut it, 
without them curved scissors, I never even look at it really on the other side with them curved scissors because I get it when I cut it off. But I had to take these scissors here and uh, trim it down because I want that bad boy to be nice and sleek and perfect all the way around. Check that out, y'all. Check it out. I guarantee you, we gonna be on a crappie with that bad boy here in a little bit, y'all. Uh, we got a Shiner series, but we don't have the Shad series. We do, but it's been a while since we talked about it. So this right here is the original Shad, y'all. The original Shad. I guarantee you that sucker will be in a crappie's mouth this afternoon. Y'all be on the lookout for my shorts for a full video. I'll try to post some shorts today to see them when we're fishing. And I will show you exactly how this jig works on the water. Look, God bless each and every one of y'all. And we will see y'all next time. Happy New Year now. Y'all have a good one.